Hey there. Do you guys remember when Realms SMP was still around? I'm just gonna oh, use my shield. I, <laughs> I have the shield of rage. Use my shield. Should we just say season five? What do you guys think? Season five? All right. Here we go. Do, do, what? What? Do, do we just accept it? Do we just accept that in <laughs> our entire world just disappeared? That time I pulled a $1,000 Pokemon card. Oh, it's shiny too. No, no, no. Weedle. Inkplay. Hattery. And... Oh. When Block City was just beginning. I will take your life. Wait, what? No, no. Ow. Okay, okay, okay. Stop, 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 stop. Please, please. What, what the... Wait, what is happening? Huh? When we played random games on the channel... Oh, this is too good. This is too awesome. If if I can't have you, no one can. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. <laughs> when I made cooking videos. Whoa, this actually. Wait, guys. This actually kind of looks good. Are you crying? No. Bro, I can't. Hey, he's crying a little bit. Bro, what do you mean? Get a close up. I'm fine. <laughs> when you eat lumpia. And even those dumb skits that I used to make. Actually, hello? Don't hello me. Do you know your problem? Dude, what is your issue, man? You know how long it's been since you dropped the song? Oh my god, do you need to drop some music? Some music! Am I hearing this? Yeah, you're hearing this, now you better listen up. I can't believe I'm talking to a Nintendo Switch right now. I'm just playing some Call of Duty Warzone with my friends, man. Well, those are some of my all-time favorite moments on the channel and the happiest I've ever felt making content. And how many of these moments were in the past year? None. That was around the time when I had three to four million subscribers. And it was also around the time I was able to inspire a lot of you guys watching the videos to, you know, follow your dreams. And, you know, even some of you guys were like, you're the reason why I started a YouTube channel. And it was like the best feeling I've ever had making content on YouTube. Since then, my content has changed so much. Not even my content, this entire channel. I feel like, you know, everything that we used to do no longer exists. Like, I haven't made a video like this in such a long time where I sit down and talk to you guys and catch up with the Rage Nation. Like, back then, I would make these videos every few months just to catch up with you guys, the Rage Nation. Um, and for those who used to watch my videos back then, I am so, so sorry. I know, I know, I know you guys missed the Realms SMP, the survival series, the scary videos, the TikTok hacks, the cooking videos. There was so much that was going on on, on this channel and I feel like, you know, in a sense, I abandoned you guys. Um, so I, I just want to say I'm sorry and for those who are still left, because I know not many people are going to watch this video because the audience I have nowadays don't really care about, you know, me as a person and I just realized that now it's a little too late, but you know, I got to take my first steps into building this community again. And I, I just want to say, I'm sorry for those who used to watch my videos back then when I was having so much fun making content, please comment down below hashtag rage nation for the, for the rage nation, the OG rage nation that is still left. I will go ahead and heart some of your comments. If you guys go down below and comment hashtag rage nation, I would really appreciate, um, you know, seeing old faces and the people who used to be around for me, me for me and not just Minecraft content. I've mentioned this before, but whenever I make these types of videos, I tend to ramble on a little too much. I tend to go in circles with the things I say. So I made some notes, um, just to make sure I stay on track. Um, but basically, you know, I mentioned in my old videos that one thing that couldn't have been taken away from me, I feel like I abandoned that. I was the one who chose to lose it because 
I saw that Minecraft roleplay content was doing really well at the time and I decided, you know what, let me just double down because YouTube likes it when you make only one type of content and not spread yourself too thin. And that's why I decided, you know what, I'm just going to go all in on Block City content because that's what you guys were enjoying at the time. And, you know, now looking back, I made a huge mistake because now, you know, not many of you guys enjoy Block City anymore. I think I went a little too long with Block City content, Minecraft roleplay content, and I got a little too comfortable. Listen, I want to be 100% honest with you guys. There was a time, pretty recently actually, where I kind of got a little too comfortable and took you guys for granted. And I've, that, that just hurts me to say because I've told you guys many, many times that whatever happens, I would never take you guys for granted. I would never take your support. I would never take my job for granted. And here I was just getting really lazy with the ideas. With the videos, I feel like the videos were getting very repetitive. And I think you guys can tell, you know, you guys aren't stupid. You guys saw the videos and you guys were like, wow, the stories seem very similar. And I guess the videos started getting, you know, boring to you guys. And less and less of you guys started clicking on my videos and the views, it went down. And obviously that hurts me as a YouTuber, you know, as a YouTuber, you always want to grow. You always want to keep going up. But... It's my fault. Obviously, while it was happening, I was freaking out, you know? I was like, you know, something has to be wrong with YouTube. Oh gosh, it's over for me. But at the end of the day, only I'm the one to blame. It's my channel. It's my responsibility to make great videos. And that's why for the past few weeks, I've been waking up at 6, 7 in the morning and stay up until like 11, 12 at night just straight grinding just thinking about youtube videos thinking about how i can make these videos better how i can you know focus and you know make you guys happy again the rage nation and make content that you guys really want to watch instead of just putting out content just to put out content i don't want to become that youtuber you know i'm sitting here thinking to myself like should i even upload this video because i don't know if you guys will care at all but at the same time, I just want to put it out there for myself to look back at. <sighs> I don't know. Anyways, I'm done rambling on. Let me get to the main point of this video. There's been many times where my channel has gone to rock bottom and I've managed to bring it back. But like I said, I'm going to be honest, it's very exhausting and it's such a hard process to do, but this is the last time I'm going to try to build a strong community again. And I promise this time, I promise guys, I promise I won't let you guys go. I won't abandon you guys. Well, it felt like I was abandoning you guys. I, you know, there are so many of you guys were enjoying the Block City content, but instead of just removing all the other series, I should have continued making other styles of content while I was making roleplay content. So what I'm trying to say is, Roleplay content will still remain on the channel, but I will be bringing back all the different series that I used to do on this channel because it makes things more fun for me. And I think you guys see how fun it is for me and how fun it is to watch for you guys. I just want to apologize to all the viewers that genuinely enjoyed my content for me and not for the game. I think I mentioned this in a video I made a long time ago. If one game dies, and if I solely just made Minecraft videos and Minecraft died, my channel would die with it. So I want you guys to keep that in mind, you know? When you're supporting your favorite uh, creators, just just remember that they're, they're trying their best to, you know, keep their job going as well, to keep their job at the end of the day. I think at the point where the channel is at, if Minecraft died tomorrow, I'm dying with it. Um, all the viewers that stayed with me to watch me play other games, I think they're no longer here. And totally understand. It's all my fault. I'm the one who chose to double down on the roleplay content and abandon all the other series. You guys know what this is? This right here is an iPod Touch 4th generation that I received 
as a birthday gift in sixth grade. And this is how I was able to make my first videos ever. I would record myself dancing using the camera right here, this tiny little camera that you guys see right there. And I was able to make content. I started playing mobile games, recorded, uh, <laughs> recorded my iPod touch using another iPod touch that my uncle had taped it to the table so I could record my hands my fingers were in the way and you see how small this tiny little screen is yeah I still managed to make content using this little thing so you know what what I'm trying to say is you can make content with anything and I've come a very long way I can't take this for granted I gotta keep pushing, I gotta keep making better content for you guys and what I'm trying to say is the people watching this video right now, you guys have some awesome videos to look forward to. Rage Elixir is a name that I created when I was 12 years old and I can't just throw away that name and let it end here. I refuse to. I want to keep going and make YouTube videos for as long as I, I possibly can because I. <laughs> This is my dream job. I've been wanting to become a YouTuber ever since I was in third grade. So, you know, I can't be getting comfortable like this. You guys notice my gaming setup? It's totally different from what it used to be. I feel like my setup now shows more of my personality outside of just making Minecraft videos. Believe it or not, this might be a shocker to you, but I don't sit here at my setup all day playing Minecraft 24 seven. Oh my goodness, it looks so beautiful. This thing right here has been making me so happy. It's been helping me make better videos for you guys. Now, before I end this video, there's a couple things I wanna mention. So many things have changed in my life. You know, there's someone I'm interested in. Um, I've been vlogging with her over on my vlog channel. If you guys haven't seen my vlog channel, I've been posting vlogs pretty often. Uh, we might be making some cooking videos together. Um, and I know you guys miss my cooking videos, so I'll be making more cooking videos. Don't you worry. There's actually lots and lots of different things I want to do on this channel. I want this to be a long term project. I want this channel to last as long as I do. This might sound sad, but I don't know when I'm going to go and I want to make sure I'm really happy with the things that I do every single day and live my life to the fullest every day and YouTube gives me purpose. You guys give me purpose. You guys clicking on my videos every single day whenever I do post, you guys give me purpose. So anyways, thanks so much for watching. I love you guys and you guys can look forward to some amazing content coming soon. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one, all right? Peace.